if I made them nervous, and I got too nervous, you know, I, I knew they'd shoot. She came face to face with one of the suspects in a crime spree, ending with a Houston police officer shot. Tonight, she's exclusively speaking to Channel 2 News about this horrifying experience. Good evening. Thank you for joining us. I'm Dominique Soxa. I'm Keith Garvin. We have live team coverage tonight. We begin with Channel 2 Sally Mamdu, live where the crime spree began. Griggs and Scott on Houston Southside. And Sally, this had to be terrifying for this woman. The woman tells me those moments were very horrifying to her, but she is glad she wasn't hurt. A violent crime spree sweeps through Houston's south side late Thursday, sending an HPD officer to the hospital and terrifying others. I was in total shock, um, beyond shock, you know, but just able to keep my cool to save my life. This woman, who out of fear for her safety, didn't want to reveal her identity, was one of the three people caught in the middle of this crime spree. She exclusively shared with us the terrorizing few moments she endured as she pulled into her driveway. The guys were banging on my, with a gun against my, my window on the driver's side. Three men, she says, ordered her out of her pickup truck. One of them had a gun pointed right at her. So I got out, uh, um, kind of at some point, Turn my back, you know, towards, you know, going facing it with my hands up, um, you know, kind of surrendering myself. And he asked for the phone. Um, I give him the phone, and he proceeds to ask for the code for the phone. Um, so I give him that, and, you know, I step back. He says, he says, you know, that better be the code. The three men then got into the truck and took off. Prior to carjacking the woman, police say the suspect stole another car from a man at this Valero gas station on the corner of Scott and Griggs. They later ditched it because it ran out of gas. They then stole this priest's phones, beat him up, pointed a gun at him, and tried to shoot him, but the gun never fired. He shot at me, couldn't he? made the second you know, attempt. He couldn't, he was struggling with his, uh, so the, the rest of them started, you know, beating me. Meanwhile, this woman is glad the suspects left without physically harming her. I knew that if I made them nervous and I got too nervous, you know, I, I knew they'd shoot. The woman also tells me that luckily she'll be able to get her pickup truck back. We're live in Houston's Southside. Sally Mabdu, KPRC, Channel 2 News.